how to upload audio on Canva. Let's jump on it. Well, first of all, it's very important for you to understand that you first need to create your video or slideshow project, for example, and only after that you can upload audio. You cannot upload audio first and then take it from there. With that said, let's have a look at how to get it done. First of all, in the upper right corner of the screen, click on create a design. You could then go with a custom size project or for example with a video project. As we want to add audio, we're actually going with a video project right here. So I click on video. And once you have a project opened up, there are two basic ways for you to add audio on Canva. The first one is by using the uploads tab here in the left sidebar. Click on it. And then click on upload files. And you can then locate the audio file on your computer. In my case, I have the audio file here under documents and then in this folder audio to upload to Canva. So we just left click on the audio file that we would like to upload. And then on the lower right, we click on open. This will upload our audio here under the audio tab in the upload section of Canva. Now the second way to upload audio in Canva is even easier and that is by drag and drop. So I have Canva maximized here for the moment. I'm gonna change that by clicking here on this green icon in the upper left corner of the screen to exit full screen. And now to upload audio on Canva using this way, all you need to do is to left click and hold on your audio file and you can then simply drop it here onto Canva. It doesn't matter if you put it right here or right here. As soon as you hover over Canva with your audio file, this drop files to upload thing will be activated and once you let go of the left mouse button, your audio file is automatically uploaded. Now I took this audio file here right from the finder on my Mac, but this also works if you have your audio file on the desktop for example, and no matter if it is on a Mac or a PC. So these are the two basic ways to upload audio to Canva. Once you have your audio files here in Canva, to add them to your project, all you need to do is to click on it. And once you've done that, it will appear here under your project on the timeline. Now on the left side, I'm also quickly going to add a video by tapping here on the video tab in the left sidebar. And let me just choose this one right here. So I just click on it to add it. Then you can right click on your video and select set video as background. And as you can see, after we added our video here, our audio actually automatically expanded to the very same length of the video. Now, if that is not what you want, you can always adjust the length of the audio again, of course. To do that, simply hover over the beginning or the very end of the audio track and you can then simply drag. Like this you can easily adjust the audio. On top of that when you click on the audio, above your project you will then also see a loudspeaker icon. When you click on that you can easily adjust the volume of your audio track. Another cool thing that you can do with your audio are fades. So you can fade in your audio track and then at the end of the video you can fade it out. To do that once again you would need to make sure to left click on your audio track and then on top here go to audio effects. You can then choose a fade in. I will put that to maybe one second. And then I'm also going to choose a fade out of one second as well. And as you can see this has been automatically added here to our audio track. This is the fade in at the very beginning and this is the fade out at the very end. Now let me change the length of our audio track again so that it will actually finish when our video is ending as well. Last but not least, let me also say this. If you don't want to use your very own audio, Canva actually also provides some audio. You can find that here in the left sidebar under audio. There you can choose from a wide range of music. To add one of these to your project, simply click on it. And the audio track will then be added to your project right here. Now, as I didn't delete our other audio track, we end up with having two audio tracks here on the timeline at the very same time. In this case here, we don't want that. So I'm simply going to select our first audio track and then I press delete on my keyboard to delete it from our project. And that's it guys. This is all you need to know about how to upload audio on Canva. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to smash the like button and subscribe for more Canva tutorials.